Some nights I call it a draw. I always loved math and science and when I started going on college visits my junior year I really wanted to visit the engineering schools to see what they were like. I found out what they were doing with research and for their future careers I thought it was exactly what I wanted to do. I did an internship in high school that really showed me what engineering was and how much I love to do it. My grandfather was an electrical engineer. He would always give me math problems every time I'd go over. I was a huge nerd, but I loved it. And I loved science as well, and I couldn't decide between math and science, and so the perfect combination of both was engineering. It had to do with my high school. We had an engineering academy program there. My senior year, we had a capstone course that was the first robotics competition. So I was able to get my hands dirty and see what SolidWorks was like, different CAD programs. So that really got me interested in what possibilities engineering had. When I was younger, I liked to make things and to build things. And then as I got older, I realized that writing and reading and then mathematics and science became my favorite subjects. So I chose engineering because I thought it would be a good balance between all of the things that I enjoy doing. I had a mentor in high school who was really inspirational and I worked for her and ended up learning a lot of engineering concepts a little bit early and that inspired me to become an engineer myself. I decided to get into computer science after taking a few classes in high school in web development and web programming and I really liked it so I decided to pursue that as a career. There were kind of three main things that I wanted in college. First, very good academics. Secondly, to be able to do the other things I like to do outside of engineering. And finally, to get the heck out of Indiana and go someplace I wanted to live. And USC was perfect. The community. I loved that there was so much with the Trojan family, the spirit of it all, football game. It just gets in your system and makes you want to be here and want to participate. It has a fantastic support system. You have so many resources and you're in the middle of one of the greatest cities on Earth. CS 101, it was kind of my foundation to computer programming, software engineering, and I got to work with robotics as well, and that was an awesome experience to introduce me to computer science. My senior capstone class where we get to design our own space-based solar power system. I'm a biomedical engineer, and so I take almost every single science class possible, and I love the diversity it gives, and I get to talk about tissue engineering, mechanical engineering, electrical engineering. I pretty much kind of get a little taste of everything, which I think is really great, and then apply it to medicine all in the end, which I love. Center for Engineering Diversity is a support group for all minority students, which in, um, includes women as well. They have lots of different resources, and everyone, every, all the staff in there really want to see you succeed. The Society, Society of, women of Women Engineers. This year, I'm the president, and it's really a great support program, I think, because it's a huge network, and you get to know people and make friends and get leadership skills and professional skills, and I got my job through it. Associate students of biomedical engineering, and I get to meet a lot of the older kids, and they get to tell me all their experiences with biomedical engineering. A lot of corporate representatives come in and talk to us, and it's really great to hear all the opportunities that we have. Voice class, breakthrough dance, Air Force ROTC, peer health educator, an improv class, Society of Hispanic Professional Engineers, singing in a number of choir, playing intramural soccer. Sometimes I'll teach myself new languages just to further develop my programming skills. And some dance classes, the solo to class, belong club, sorority, piano course, USC equestrian team, fun to field, and it's a soccer based philanthropy. After I graduate, I'll commission as a second lieutenant and I'll move to Pensacola and train as a combat systems officer. I have a full-time job at Boeing here in El Segundo working on satellites. I would like to work for a company that specifically works with orthopedic implants. Actually, I would like to continue my education. I really hope to spend some time being a Disney Imagineer and eventually go into consulting and project management in the tech field. I want to go into USC's progressive degree program and get my master's in biomedical engineering. And from there, I'm thinking of doing more of the regulations or business side of biomedical engineering. Work abroad in other countries and use some of the tools that we have here in America and other countries to make their, their techniques of building and their cities safer. I'd like to be able to make something, make a product, something that is beneficial, is useful, that helps people in their everyday lives and be able to see it implemented everywhere.